Number six, several years ago, the mean height of women 20 years of age or older was 63.7. Suppose a simple random sample of 45 women who are 20 years of age or older today results in a mean of 64.7. We're gonna answer the three parts. So first, we're gonna state the appropriate null and alternative. <clears throat> we are given that the mean is 60. 3.7 so that's going to be mean equals 63.7 we are testing whether they are taller so greater than is going to be our alternative 64 rule number 63 and it says greater than so e looks good if the p-value for this test is 0 0.01 what does this value represent so definition of p-value is the probability that we would get a sample mean this value or more extreme is 0 0.01 that's the chance that that happens if the population mean is truly 63.7 so one percent probability sample mean of this or shorter nope more taller uh, one percent probability mean is 63.7 nope that's using the mean we're talking about the sample mean that's from the population probability one percent of obtaining sample mean height of exactly not exactly uh, probability obtaining a sample mean height of this inches or taller from a population whose mean is 67 yes all right and we're going to write a conclusion if alpha is equal to 0 0.05 so if our p-value, which is 0 0.01, less than alpha, we will reject the null. It falls in the rejection region. So there's evidence that shows that it is possible that the actual mean height of women 20 years of age or older is greater today than it was um, when the mean was done. So we are going to reject the null. So these say do not. We are going to reject the null. There's sufficient evidence to conclude the mean height of women is greater today.